Hey guys! Welcome back to my channel! And today, I will be giving you guys five tips to keep your teeth white. So, I hope this video helps you guys. And if you already have white teeth, then maybe you can tell someone else about these tips. So, I hope this helps, and let's get into the video. Okay, guys, so the very top number one thing that you need to do in order to have white teeth is brushing your teeth. Now, it does depend on how much you brush your teeth, the time you brush your teeth, the type of toothpaste you brush your teeth with, and, like, I don't know, like, if it's how hard you brush your teeth. I don't think it's that, but, like, how much time you put into brushing your teeth. Even if you brush your teeth five times a day, if you only brush your teeth for five seconds, that doesn't count. You need to brush your teeth for at least one minute and twice a day at least and three times a day if you have braces, I recommend. Probably more than three times a day if you have braces because food is always getting stuck in your teeth. But I cannot say it enough. You have to brush your teeth at least twice a day in order to have somewhat form of white teeth. I usually brush my teeth twice or three times a day. It depends. Like, if I eat some candy, I'll probably, like, brush my teeth or use... Sometimes I use this mouth rinse. Or sometimes I'll use the anti-cavity. But I use anti-cavity before bed. And make sure you guys are brushing your teeth at least twice a day. Now, let's get to the second step. The second tip that you can use in order to have white teeth is to use whitening strips or whitening strips toothpaste. Now, if you guys are wondering what whitening strips toothpaste is, whitening strips toothpaste is just this. It is, oh, sorry, it's almost gone. But whitening strip toothpaste is just toothpaste that has little whitening strips in it and it's like when you brush with it, it's like putting whitening strips onto your teeth and it's not harmless and it's not bad for your teeth. It's not whitening, it's whitening strips and they're safe and okay. So yeah guys, that's another great option to do is to use whitening strips toothpaste or just any type of random whitening toothpaste. Number three. Number three is to go to the dentist. I go to the dentist every, every six months. That's usually when they schedule appointments. I think that's the usual time because every time I go to the dentist, they always say the next six months, next six months. But if you don't go to the dentist, then you probably won't get like, when you go to the dentist, they clean your teeth and they put like this special type of chemical, not a chemical, it's like a gel, it tastes kind of like bubble gum, and it whitens your teeth and it keeps your teeth strong. And for me, they put on anti-cavity because I have like, I have all adult teeth now, so they just put this like... I don't know, it's like, I don't know, some type of anti-cavity thing on my teeth so that way I don't get, like, my adult teeth ruined or anything. But yeah, guys, you have to go to the dentist in order to keep up white teeth. Number four. Number four is to use mouthwash. Mouthwash is a great way to keep your teeth pearly white as well because certain types of mouthwash will really help out your teeth, especially if you just ate something really sugary or something like that, mouthwash is a great way to solve that problem. Personally, I like to recommend the green mint kind or the anti-cavity kind. It can be found anywhere like Walmart or Family Dollar. It's not really that expensive, so it's quite affordable. So, I do recommend that. And, in my night routine video, you get to see specifically the type of mouthwash that I like to use. It is a, like, I like it because it's, like, it's not, like too hot or anything like it doesn't like burn your mouth so i would recommend it for kids and adults so yeah let's get on to number five number five is to floss i think that flossing can like keep food out of your teeth and another thing that i've noticed if you eat something that's blue your tongue will probably have blue stains on it and your teeth might get blue stained a little bit. If you floss, I think that it kind of gets like the dye out of your tooth or teeth a little bit because like at the end of the floss that I, that I like to use, it has like a little prick thing and you can put it in your teeth to get it out in specific spots. So I do recommend to floss every night and every morning, but if you can't floss at night or if you don't feel like flossing in the morning, try to do one. 
So yeah guys, those are all the tips that I have for you to keep your teeth white. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you guys do try out any of these strategies, make sure you put down below in the comment section how they work for you. And yeah, I'll be back with more videos this week. So stay tuned. Bye. No,